Happy Monday. Thank you to all our subscribers. We reached a thousand subscribers last week, so we appreciate everybody for commenting, sharing, subscribing. Uh, hope everyone's enjoying the workouts. We have a really fun week of workouts this week. Monday is going to be catch and release. Every four minutes for five rounds, you're gonna complete a 50 foot double dumbbell walking lunge, followed by a 21 or 15 calorie row, followed by 12 kipping handstand push-ups, followed by nine barbell deadlifts. First movement is going to be a double dumbbell front rack walking lunge. You can hold the dumbbells anyway, as long as they're on top of your shoulders. Lunge 25 feet forward, and then turn around and lunge 25 feet back. If you don't have room to lunge, you can perform 18 stationary alternating lunges. After the dumbbell walking lunge, men will perform a 21 calorie row, women a 15 calorie row. Let's try to keep a strong midline by sitting up tall. We're gonna need to engage our core for the remaining three movements of this workout. After you finish your row, you're gonna proceed and perform 12 kipping handstand push-ups. Kick, kick up against the wall, carefully lower your head to the floor, tuck your knees below hip level, and then aggressively kick up once your hips straighten and you kick up, finish the press out with the arms. If you don't have kipping handstand push-ups, you can substitute 15 hand release push-ups. Finally, you'll move to a barbell. We're performing nine barbell deadlifts. You need to focus on keeping our lower back straight and we can remember to push the hips and knees back as we lower the barbell to the floor. The home gym variation today is gonna to follow the same interval format every four minutes for five total rounds. Start with 20 alternating jumping lunges. Back knee gently touches the floor. Next, 20 hand release push-ups. Maintain the plank as you perform these push-ups, try to avoid worming or arching on the way up or the way down. Next, 20 air squats. And finally, 20 double dumbbell deadlifts. Take a narrow stance with your feet. The dumbbells are gonna touch, single, side of, single head of the dumbbell touches outside the feet on every rep. Today's first body armor accessory piece will be three sets, maxed effort, L-sit. Try to keep the knees locked out and the toes above hip level. To scale, we're gonna tuck the knees and hold that position. After each set, you're gonna perform a 100 meter double dumbbell or double kettlebell farmer's carry. Stand up tall, keep the shoulder blades pulled back, avoid leaning or arching for your farmer's carry. You'll perform two farmer's carries and three total sets of max effort L6. Today's second body armor accessory piece will be three sets, 20 GHD sit-ups, followed by 30 GHD hip extensions, followed by a 400 meter skier. If you don't have access to a GHD, you'll perform 20 weighted ab mat sit-ups. And 30 good mornings. 
You can weigh these using a band or a plate hugged to the chest. And finally, you'll replace the 400 meter ski erg with a 400 meter run.